What's up, YouTube? It's your boy, NLV Assassin. Uh, I wanted to do this unboxing real quick because one, I don't see this monitor online too much. And everybody who's done them, like, like if I find it, it's either, you know, 32 GN 650 or it's the 850 or anything. So I wanted to be one of the people who went over this and put it up there for everybody. So um, I have another monitor upstairs. It's a Asus. Uh, if you want to see that unboxing, it was a quick unboxing. I just really didn't care too much for the unboxing. Uh, it'll be in on my channel. But uh, anyways, so let's get to this. So this is the LG, uh, LG Ultra Gear 32GN600 1440p. Let's zoom in real quick. 1440p 2K monitor, uh, QHD, got HDR10, AMD FreeSync, 165 hertz refresh rate, one millisecond motion blur reduction and it's a VA panel. Uh, the panel I have upstairs is TN, so it's gonna be good. You know, a lot of people say IPS and da 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 And I'll do more reviews on this once I hook it up. Uh, I'm not going to hook up the base. I'm going to have it on a monitor stand. I got a dual monitor stand upstairs that I just bought, and I already put my ASUS on there. Uh, so it's gonna be good for gaming, and when I do my uh, studio sessions and stuff, I can open up Pro Tools and, and uh, fruity loops and have everything open in two screens. You know, I'm used to working in two screens and for a long time, I've been working with one screen in my studio and it's not very productive for me. So anyways, it's, it's gonna be good to have this. So let me get this uh, package. It says normal response time of VA panels is five milliseconds GTG with one millisecond motion blur reduction. Technology high response time reaches up to one millisecond by turning off the backlight during the rising and falling period of the liquid crystal without creating and doubling the frames. So, up here at the top, two HDMI, DPI inputs. Uh, turn this around so you can see this. I'm not seeing too much more detail here. I do believe that these have a 1.4 HDMI port. Uh, or maybe somebody, I think somebody online said it was a 2.0, but either way. So let's go ahead and lay this down. It says this is the front. So I'm gonna go ahead and lay this down and cut the box open for you real quick. And yeah, I really wanted to do this because I really searched for this, this uh, monitor online and I didn't see too many unboxings and or, you know, reviews. So I'm gonna be very active in reviewing this uh, and very active in this unboxing. So let's get this folded. I hope that green screen doesn't fall down. Should have changed it to a black or white, but who cares? Uh, here we go. Got this here. All right, so looks like it has a, okay, keeping this. It's gonna be easy to pack up when I move. Uh, has a little tape there to hold that in. So we'll put that down on the ground over there. Oh wow, this thing is pretty big. Oh my, this thing is beautiful. Holy crap. Well, so the screen that I have upstairs, just to let you guys know, is a 27 inch. Um, and this is 31 and a half. My goodness. This thing is massive. Hold on, looks like something's stuck here. So let's see what's going on. Whoever packed this is drunk or something. Uh, let's lift this styrofoam up. See if it gives us some relief. No, it's got tape down to the box or something. Very weird. My goodness, that is massive. I didn't realize. I mean, 32 inches, you know. Good Lord. It's like a baby TV right there. So we got this going. It looks, uh, oh my. So let's take this off and let's see LG. Okay, so that's what we got. Let's turn it around. G Money Cricket. So 
DP, uh, what is it? DPI, Display Port, I'm sorry. Display Port in, HDMI 1, HDMI 2. Don't mind my hair, I didn't brush my hair today, I don't care. Uh, headphones, and the power. Uh, where you can mount it, this is where I'm gonna mount it. And then it also has a little place there for the stand. So, this is pretty heavy too. That's very flat. So I'm gonna take this over here to my other table to lay it down. That, that thing is massive. Holy crap. I didn't realize it was that big, but that's even better because if I get a good refresh like that, it's gonna be good. So, so we got this here to pack it in and then it looks like we got the base. Uh, it's the base here. And we also have the stand neck, which I will not be using these. Like I said, I will be mounting this. So we have the base, the base neck and the base stand. So won't be using that. Then we got paperwork here. So let's see here. Oh, it comes with a CD. Oh my, who still has that on their computer? I do, I have a Blu-ray drive. Uh, let's see what else we have. Everybody said the power cord was bulky. It's not that bulky. It's fine to me. Did it come with any HDMI cords? It doesn't look like it. I don't know what the heck that is. Some kind of bracket or something. Uh, That's probably for the base. These are screws for the base. I'm not gonna use any of that crap. Oh, this is a display. It came with a display cord. Display port, so that's fine. Uh, so let's take a look. The literature, screen, disc, display port, Cord. Doesn't have the HDMI, that's all right. It has this little clips here and screws. Like I said, I'm not gonna be using any of that. I'm gonna be using uh, a monitor clip. Has instructions here on how to do it, which would be nice. Maybe one day I'll use it, it just depends. But like I said, I'm not getting rid of this box. So this box is just going to the garage. I'll tape it back closed. So you got your display port, your HDMI, and your headset headphones. So it says service only. I don't think it had a USB on the back. Let me go look. Not that I can tell. doesn't have a USB on the back, so that's fine. Uh, like I said, we, we won't be using much of this, so let me pack that back up. It says mail today to register. I don't know who does that when I'm just gonna go online and register. They can save that tree. I don't know why they push, put that in there, but either way, I don't think anybody mails in registration anymore when you can just go online and do it. Uh, so. DVI cord, I mean display cord, display port, I'm gonna hook that up to my 1660 Super. And the other display port will be in my Asus. So got that, very quick unboxing. So what I'm gonna do guys is, is I will Record another video and attach it to this one, edit it in and make it one video and then we'll see how it's set up and we'll be good to go. And then I'll do some review videos later on. Until then, I'm NLV Assassin. Holla at you.